Hello YouTube, just doing a real quick video here. I am distilling mercury. For a friend of mine that owns a neon sign shop, he had a whole bunch of dirty mercury and he was wondering if I could distill it for him so that he can use it in his lights, hopefully. Um, I'm going to say right off the bat, this is stupidly dangerous to do. You should not try this at home. I have the proper equipment, proper setup, everything's sealed, everything's isolated. I have a vacuum trap. It's a completely closed system. <clears throat> um, but yeah, I just thought you'd like to see it. It's pretty neat to see mercury vaporize and recondense. You'll be able to see it run down the condenser there in a second. I'll go in and I'll show you it boiling. I'm going to be uh, doing a triple distillation of this stuff. And I'll show you guys the crap that comes out of it in another video along with the finished product. I have about 13 pounds of the stuff to work with. So. Uh, it's going to be taking me quite some time because it is the most dense substance known that's not radioactive anyway um, it takes forever to heat up this has been heating up for about an hour and a half and it takes forever <coughs> but I'm just going to go into the fume head here with the camera and I'll show you it boiling I'll show you how it condenses on the glass and everything else Again, I want to say that you should not try this at home. You should never even heat up mercury unless you know what you're doing. So please do not try this at home. For anybody interested, I'm running a vacuum of 250 millimeters mercury. And the boiling point at that temperature is approximately 324 or 25 degrees Celsius. The chiller is running, it's set at zero, it has a differential of three degrees Celsius, so that'll go up to three degrees, and then the chiller will kick in and bring it back down to zero. And that's one of my homemade heating mantles. I tried to use a professional heating mantle for this, and it just plain does not get hot enough. So you kind of have to use a homemade heating mantle or a very high quality heating mantle to do this. Or a flame with a lead bath or a sand bath, something along those lines. Bismuth metal bath, something like that. Um, for anybody else interested, the heating mantle is running at 4 amps at about 75 volts AC.
and it's collecting pretty nicely. Some deposits on there right now. This is the first distillation, so I wasn't as concerned as to having spit shined glassware um, because it's right now I'm just getting rid of any amalgams if there are any present. When I do the final distillation, the glassware is going to be spit shined completely clean so that there won't be any, um, any deposits on the surface of the mercury. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.